Hi, this is Carol Harnett with a One Take Work Love Play daily video blog. And I'm going to pick up today where I left off on Friday. Today is Sunday, so happy Halloween. I'm going to pick up today with this more specifics about 12 at 12 and where we're headed and, and use that as an example for you about crowdsourcing. So essentially what we submitted to the Institute for the Future, the Body Shock Challenge, was this concept of what was called 12 at 12, which was a moniker that Stephen Warshaw from Lynchpin at Large came up with. And the idea was this, at 12 noon, in any given employer that was participating, employees could take 12 minutes to do anything that would be related to their health that they wanted to do. So they could go for a walk, they could climb stairs, they could stretch, they could relax and simply breathe. They could go get a nutritious lunch. They could do something that is just for them. After they had done it, um, there would be a mechanism for them to record it. Now, one of the things that was suggested in order to build a sense of crowd and a sense of mass is that they could tweet it with a special hashtag, like hashtag or pound sign for some of you that simply had 12 at 12. Um, attached to this would be a recording, obviously, of how these employees were doing. And if an employee participated in 12 at 12 for 12 weeks, the employer would, would agree to grant them an extra 12 minutes every day that they could take to use just for themselves. Now, why everybody doing it 12 noon? And again, it's the concept of mass. There's a lot of information growing and a lot of research growing around the idea that essentially knowing that everyone else is doing something uh, adds to people's participation. In fact, in today's New York Times, in the magazine section, there is an article that discusses how you influence voting. And you don't influence voting and getting people to the polls by talking about the issue. You say that everybody's going to the polls today. And it's that sense of mass. Now, in addition to people doing it for 12 weeks, they could do it once a week, by the way. We made no more parameters than they had to do it at least once a week. They could do it five times a week. They would get in these additional 12 minutes. We would also start to build in rewards. Rewards, for example, that uh, the research also shows need to be immediate, but they also need to be unexpected. So, for example, it's not that every time that you would log something in with the hashtag 12 or 12 that you would get some kind of reward, but it would happen very frequently and it would always happen right after the behavior. So that's really where we are. If you want to join the continued discussion for how we're actually going to start to implement this and pilot this on a pro bono basis for employers who are interested, go out to Social Strata and or uh, do a search, a Bing search, a Google search, whatever kind of search, Yahoo search you want to do, and put in the term health crowds. Uh, you can put in my name, Carol Harnett. You can put in the term 12 at 12, and you should get a hit for our channel where we're going to be discussing this. So please join us. This is Carol Harnett with the One Take Work Love Play daily video blog, and I hope you remember to do a little bit of work today, a lot of love, and some play. Happy Halloween. Bye.